It looked like I had four butts going on, to be honest. Alicia said, why are you laughing? Because <laughs> you just disagree with me. It it like in those. But it's so thick that, like, I feel like you wouldn't be able to. Let's set the tone. A bottle of red wine and pheromones. The conversation flows. A couple of hours. See how it goes I really trust my senses Catch me if I fall So done with second guessing You seem to have it all In loving before anything Emotional too soon You got my invitation Now the rest is up to you Kick it rendezvous Make some time for me and you Get you over, treat you right family channel and the crew if you are watching for the first time my name is alicia i hope you guys enjoy all of our content all of our blog videos that we put out anything that you need to know about us with all of our social media profiles everything will be in the description box below along with all of our other channels i went on to two different sites and purchased me some clothes i went to dear lover which I found them from my girl, Tiffany Sherelle. I will leave her link to her channel in the description box below. Y'all go over there and tell her that we sent y'all. And also, I went on Shein, and I got four dresses from them. So yeah, I'm not most auntie. They like this. <laughs> yeah, my daughter laughing at me because she said I got the auntie yeah. saying, hey, dude, it is what it is. All right, y'all, this first dress that I am sharing for you all, all of my dresses that, well, no, not all of them, two of my dresses, I did have to get an extra large because these came from Dear Lover. And on the Dill Level website, because they are overseas, I choose to go up a size because I would rather get in and be a little bit bigger than too small. So this one here, I did get in the extra large. I'm glad I did because the large would have been too tight in my opinion because I wanted this dress to be more flowy. But the dress almost comes to my ankle. It does have a split on both sides. The split isn't too short for me. It's fine. And it is shiny, but it's not too, too shiny. As you all can see, it feels really good on the skin. I like that it's not tight on the arms because sometimes a lot of dresses that you get that's this type of material, it'll cling to your arm. And this one is not. Y'all hear my son coughing in the background. If I wait to do a video when it's quiet, I will never get videos done because it's summertime and I got churn. I got churn. So, yeah. But, like I said, it's really, really flowy, but it still accentuates your curves and accents your curves, but it hides what it's supposed to hide. I do have my shapewear on underneath here. And my shapewear, all of my shapewear that I got came from Shaper Mint. And if you guys have not seen that video, I will leave that link in the description box below. So, yeah. So, y'all let me know what y'all think about this dress. And this dress was $5.49 on the Dear Level website. And it comes from small all the way up to 4 XL. This is my second dress. Like I said, I got three dresses from them. I'm going to show you guys the third dress, but I'm not going to try it on. I actually gave that one to my daughter. It fits good, but I just didn't like the way. It didn't flatter my body the way that I wanted it to. But this particular dress is my favorite. If I would have known that I liked the way this fit, I would have got this one in every color they had because they had three. And this dress was $6.98 on the Dear Level website. It got and, pockets. Yes, it has pockets. And the quality of this dress, I love it. When I tell y'all, and I don't want to compare it to another store, but like if you go to like a Burlington's or something like that and you get these type of dresses, you can wash this dress over and over. You can put this in the dryer and it's not going to fade. It's not going to shrink or anything. So the quality on this is really good. Um, I love big dresses like this. In the summertime, fall time, it doesn't matter. Because they're flowy. Like they are, you know what I mean? It's really flowy. And it feels good. It is really, really soft to touch. That's another thing. It's comfortable. If you have a midsection and you do not have to wear your body shaper with this. You can breathe and nobody won't be able to see any imperfections that you have. But it's, I just love this dress, y'all. I love this dress. I'm definitely going to order me some more and the colors and they have other styles it's the same basic style but it's just different prints but yeah the pockets is definitely a plus and they're real deep pockets like 
really, really deep pocket. And this is flowy, y'all. I don't know. I love this dress. And then the detail that's in the front of it, I like. You can dress this up. You can dress this down. This is a strapless bra that I have on, but you have the option of removing the strap. And I just kept them on. But y'all let me know what y'all think of it. It does go all the way down to the floor. And I'm just going to stand 5'6". Because a 5'5 five, five and a half, I'm going to say 5'6". And it goes all the way down. But you can wear some sandals with this. You can dress it up with some heels, whatever you choose. I know a lot of people are doing mules again. I'm just not a big fan of mules. That fashion is coming back out. But I'm not a huge fan of it. I'm either going to do heels or I'll do flats. You can also pair these with some, what you call them? Uh, like the rapper ass. The, uh, they're, uh, I'm thinking like the gladiator sandals. Yeah. With these, you know, honey, whatever you choose. And then you can pair it with a jean jacket, however. No, we're making, the flaps are coming out this summer. Well, she said the flaps, well, I don't want to do my own, but she said the flaps <laughs> are coming out this summer. But I know a lot of women love to wear their jean jackets and stuff. If you have a, a basic black cardigan or a cardigan with one a of shawl. these colors, you can do, yep, or throw I a shawl like over a it. Shawl if you don't really want your arms out. But I like this dress, y'all. So y'all let me know what y'all think. And it does go really well with my short haircut. It'll also go well if I throw on a wig. Just rocking my natural short haircut. So, all right, you guys. And this is the third dress that I told y'all. Like I said, I'm just giving this one to my daughter. I did get this in a extra large, and it does fit really nicely. It's long. It's not as long as this one. It probably comes up like about an inch or two above my ankles. This one does it have a split? No, this one does not have a split in it at all. It's just a full basic gray dress it is sleeveless it has a v-neck the quality of it is still really good it's still really soft to touch and everything but as i said i just don't like the way that i don't know that it frames my body even if i wear it without a body shaper i don't like how it frames my body but it looks really good and this dress was five dollars and some change as well I know it's going to look really good on her, but like I said, it's just, I don't know. For me, it didn't do anything, and I love the color of it. I love the gray, and if I do decide that I'm going to wear this one day, I will wear it with a long cardigan because I do have a lot of, like, floor-length cardigans that I know will look good with this because I love the front of it. It's just the back. Like, when I put it on in the back, it makes my butt look extremely big, but then you can also see my little <coughs> hand. And I don't like that. But like I said, if I am going to wear it one day, I'll just go in her closet and get it. I will pair it with a long cardigan. And then it'll look really pretty. But this was a nice dress. I think Alicia's going in there to get something. She going to get something to put on top of this. I don't see how them women can do it. They be reviewing these dresses. I don't see how they can do it. Because... But for 43, this ain't bad. Yeah, I see. 43. But see, you would have to know. Tie it or something. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's been a few days. <laughs> but you would have to be like. Yeah. And wet off the shirt. Like, like take pictures. pictures or like. Break. Uh, break that. And then like hold it. And like. And then like that. Yep. This is, be it'll be like that photo shoot yeah. kind of picture. That and yeah. Like, this will definitely be a photo shoot kind of picture for me. Be like one like dressing up, like just right. a black one. It doesn't even have to be that, but like the black that would be like dressing up, and then that you could wear with like sandals or something. Right. Yeah, it's cute. Like see, and it doesn't look that short. Yeah. Like that's the thing with like once you something on top, down, it yeah, doesn't look that short. Yeah. Or even like a regular like jean jacket, but I feel like it would have to be like a dark colored jean jacket. Yeah, because anything light, it won't. Yeah, I like it like this. I would definitely wear it like this. Mm -hmm. I'll wear it with like that jean shirt she had and do photo things. Y'all want to see the back of this? She got this from Fashion Nova, y'all. It says shut up. Mm -hmm. She got this from Fashion Nova. Yeah, oh, I like yeah. that. I like this. Mm. Okay, well, I guess next. I'm just one of those people. I love to pair dresses like this with jackets because even though I still want to look girly, I'm still very tomboy. 
And to me, it just, it flows with that. It offsets it. Because yeah. I'm not 100%, that 100% girly girl. I like to have some type of jacket to just kind of do what it's going to do. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this look or about this dress. Like I said, again, I will still wear these with tennis shoes. Every last one of my dresses I got, I will pair with some tennis. Nine times out of ten, I will not wear sandals with them. I will wear tennis shoes with all of these dresses because that's just my style. And I will wear it with a jean top or a jean jacket. Um, but you can definitely dress it up, dress it down. You got to Yeah, you got to let somebody else. Yeah, see? You can. You can do that. You can definitely do that. I like this like a black. Uh, have like a black uh, crop top on top, yeah. or like a black shirt or whatever. So yeah, you can do that. Wear this as a skirt. <laughs> okay. And it has like jail. it has an elastic band on top, so it won't fall down. Right. It's not. Yeah. It's not gonna go nowhere. Yep. Yeah, so you can pull this down and wear this as a skirt. That's cute. That really is cute as a skirt. I didn't even think about ever doing that. I'm just gonna have to excuse my bra. It's okay. It's uh, and they got the what you call them things that they wear the corsets. You know them little corsets they wear, or like the bodysuits. Oh yeah. Yeah, you can actually do like the bodysuit corsets or the bodysuits under here, and, and it doesn't still... look like a skirt. Well, I mean a dress. It doesn't right. look like a dress. Like, yeah. but yeah, you can do that and have it open. You know how like that white shirt you got. And have like that white corset or something underneath or whatever. Yeah, you can do that. And that'll look cute too. So it can be versatile. Okay. You're welcome. All right, all right. So then you get two outfits in one. Hey, make it however you want. Make it yours. And that's actually a whole look. Yeah. Like I would I would wear that out. Yeah, I do. I would too, just like this. Oh, that is cute. Well, yeah, I don't even wear dresses. No, she don't. <laughs> All right, y'all. This is the fourth one. Let me tell y'all. This thing see through. Show y'all the front. I'm gonna come close, cause this thing is see through. All of them have these cute little. What is? Yeah, this is massive, massive see through, as you can see. And with my body shape on, it just did not look right. It looked like I had four butts going on. To be honest, Alicia stated, "Why are you laughing?" Because <laughs> you just disagreed with me. It, it looked like I had four booties going on with my laughs. So I'm just gonna show y'all. Y'all gonna. Use your imagination, because I'm not pulling up this shirt. I had to actually wear some granny panties with these, or either you can't wear underwear at all with these. Okay, I'm going to stand like this. I'm going to cover this shirt up, okay? Look, if you have any kind of breast, hips, butt, I don't care. Unless you done got massive surgery done and you have not one dimple in your body. If you do, you're going to see it. You will see it. So I can recommend, unless you have one of those camis, the body shaper camis that's made like these to wear underneath, and then you won't see nothing. But if y'all don't have one of them, I ain't no other way to tell y'all how to wear this. You're going to see through with your bra, no matter what color bra you have on. And it's like a it's like a slingy material. So right. like no matter how much like stressing, stretching you right. do. It's always going to look It's going to form back. And this is an extra large, and it stretches. So it's going to stretch no matter how heavy you are. But it you, Because I am like 240-ish now. I, that number, every time I do a haul, that number keeps going up. But it's still going to pop right back to you. And it, it just is. But I like it. I like the way that it fits. I like the because it feels really good. It's a good texture. These are kind of like those underwears that just form to you. And they comfortable and you don't feel like you have underwear on. That's what it feels like. But it's a dress. Like, I think when they made this dress. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know what they could have did differently with this. Because you're going to see. It's one of those dresses through. that need two layers. Right. Because you're going to see through this dress no matter what. I mean, Like I said, I don't care if you have no children, if you have one. Even with my daughter Talia, Even she with lighting. Like if you go outside, you're gonna see you through know, it because she has no children. But because she eats, she has a little pudge. You're gonna see her pudge. But like I say, unless you bold and you just don't care. Other than that, this will just be a nightgown that I wear to bed because I can't do nothing else with this. And at night, ain't nobody gonna see me but me and a good lord. It'll look a whole lot better like this because, like I said, as a dress, 
I will not wear this as a dress because I can't wear this as a dress. I ain't going to try to act like I can. I'm not going to try to act like I can pull it off because I can't. I will wear this just as a shirt and tuck it and wear it with my jeans and a top. And I'll be good to go because I wouldn't let it go to waste. But like I said, most likely, I know I'm going to give these to my daughters. Alicia won't be able to wear this because she's just as busty as I am. So it's going to be the same thing for her. If she wear this, she's going to wear it as a, t a shirt and pair it. Because I know her. She's like I am. She'll end up pairing it with a big old jean, oversized jean shirt or a jean jacket, oversized jean jacket. Y'all the real VIPs. Let me know what y'all think. And especially with Dear Lover. Like I said, y'all know how it is with Shein. A lot of their stuff is a hit or miss. I got two pair of jeans from them. I got some shorts from them. Some of their shorts, I can fit. Some of their shorts, I have, I've been able to fit. I've gotten three dresses, a pair of shorts, and a shirt from them. And everything that I got was good quality, except for the shirt. The shirt was a little see-through, and it was like the button ripped on the back, but I just sewed it back together, and it's mm -hmm. perfect. And Rayante just went and bought her a bunch of clothes from there. And everything looked good quality. She only washed one of her outfits so far. And I did notice that when she washed it, it died really quick because it was black. That was that black one she had on. And it faded um, just with that one wash. And it was washed in cold water. But the quality of her stuff was really good and she can fit it. So like I said, it's just always a hit and miss. You got to always look in the description box. Try to get your measurements and go a size up because, like I said, sometimes it'll fit you good, sometimes it won't. It's going to depend. They do have a lot of just graphic tees. I know when I go next time I shop there, I'm probably only going to get graphic tees, and that's it. Because I probably wouldn't do any leggings, um, jeans. If I get any jeans from them, I'm definitely going to go a size up because I know if I do my true size 14 to a 16, they will not fit me. And I don't want to get anything that I got to return or end up giving away. So y'all let me know if y'all go through Shein, what y'all get. Dear lover, I love the quality of all this stuff. It fit well. The only thing that I said I had an issue with was that gray dress. Because I just didn't like the way it fit on my body. On my body type. But if I do wear it, again, I'm going to wear it with a big cardigan. But that goes to everything with me. Because that's just more of my style and how I like to wear my clothes. But thank y'all for watching. Y'all make sure y'all give this video a thumbs up, comment in the comment section. Always check the description box. Make sure you subscribe. If you're not, please go ahead on and subscribe. And make sure your post notification bells are set to on to receive all of them. And I will see y'all later. Bye, guys. Took so many years, I'm just waiting for the wins. I'm in debt to no one but the one who took my sins. I do it for real, there's no reason to pretend. If I do it once, I do it again.